So today is uh, actually it's about five and a half weeks old and uh, we got all the puppies outside here as you can see and they are so full of energy today they're all right at my feet right now as soon as I come in here they all want to want me to pick them up we have been picking them up and holding them so they they all want to do that now they are so full of life having a good time out here wrestling exploring every corner Let's see if I can move over here and get them away from me a little bit here's a just a play structure here I made for them ah there's one up there on the play structure they usually have three or four of them up there trying to be king of the hill so they enjoy that and let's see they're right now exploring the tree here's one over here we got a few little uh, toys out here for them but they like are these plastic containers because they can chew on them for their teeth plus they make a little noise and they enjoy that there's one over here Oops, got my shadow in there they're actually biting and pulling on my shoelaces so they're underneath my feet here's a couple over here hi buddy there's a little girl coming toward us this is one I call two dots because on the other side she's got two dots maybe I can a shot of the two dots. There you are, showing our two dots. Each of the puppies have a name I gave them for some distinctive marking. Now this one here, I'm looking at right now, there's two big liver spots connected and I call her connector. <laughs> it's the only way I can tell them apart. They all look a lot alike actually. This one is a little girl that has a liver face. There you are, you see her face. Pretty little girl. She's going to be grown and has a real dark liver back. And, oops, there's three of them right down here at my feet. I get my shadow on the way here. About these two guys. Three guys. Here, whoops. As you can see they're resting. That's one dot there. He has one dot on his left side. <laughs> you can see him wrestling. They love to do that. And they love that chair. See two of them up in the chair. So they sleep in a chair, usually after they get through eating. Uh, there. This is a spot on the back here, chewing on my shoe buttons. Maybe we can get a picture of her here. She's a girl. She has this distinctive spot right there across her back. That's why I call her a spot on the back. And then there's another girl over here. I get over here and I'll show you her. She's 
She's called Spot Spot Between the Shoulders. She does have a spot between the shoulders. She's got a lot of white on her. This one here that's chewing on my shoelace is a boy. He has a full overhead. There he is. He's a real pretty boy. And uh, let's see who else we got here? Uh, two dots is up there inside the kennel. Now you can see that kennel is really clean, which means that. They come out that puppy door over there, and they come down my ramp, and they go outside to do their business. And they have not been going inside at all, which is kind of surprising. Usually they do for a while, but it's very clean. So they go outside here in this outside area, and then I clean it up, of course, after them. But uh, they keep themselves pretty clean and they're pretty well housebroken, I would say. Here's one of their favorite things, a little pot pot that Pat had for her plants. They love chewing on that. They got chew marks all over it because it makes noise. Probably feels good on their teeth too. <laughs> There's one going after it now. <laughs> There's one. Yeah, they like to. Oh, he's gonna run off with it. They like rolling that around. Back up in the chair again. Two of them getting up in the chair. Anyway, you can see they have a lot of energy out here. And they got a big area to roam around in, so they are having one good time. Alright, that's it for today, so I'll sign off for today. I'll make one another video at the end of the week. I'll sign off now.